Hey, what's going on? My name is Louis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is July 21st, 2024, and welcome to the Real GS News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video, and we have a big breaking news. Red alert, the sleeping giant leader, the 4-6, humiliating withdrawal letter to terrify every sleeping giant citizens. Who on earth is running the country? Who on earth is given a green light? Sleeping Giant Aircraft and British Aircraft Correlation are flying over Western Y-E-M-E-N -E -E right now. If he stepped down, who's calling that? Who's calling that? Someone is calling the green light. Give me a second here, guys. I do have more information here I want to show you. So who's calling the... Uh, again, who's giving the green light? And then you have this one here. B-52 is activated. I just posted this video not too long ago. Guys, there's going to be more videos. Also, there's going to be videos on my new channel, The Rise Up Warrior. But uh, who's giving the green light? Someone is giving the green light. Who is running the Sleeping Giant right now? That's the big question. Who is running the Sleeping Giant? The speaker said he needs to go. If he announced that he's not going to be, you know, he passed the torch to uh, the VP. So that means that he has to go. VP needs to pick, uh, again... The VP. So who on earth is running the Sleeping Giant? Before I st uh, give me a second here, guys. Uh, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends, families, and loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get you access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. And for those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Who on earth is running this sleeping giant? He already gave the, uh, the speech. I'm out. I'm not doing this. I passed the torch to her. All right. But he said he's going to finish the remaining uh, five months. You can't. Because, it, again, you're basically leave, uh, leaving because you're not fit. If you're not fit, then you cannot serve for, you know, whatever remaining is left. So who on earth is running the Sleeping Giant? What a disgraceful end to a disgraceful you-know-who. Rather than exit this presidential, you know what, with dignity, rather than show long-suffering sleeping giant citizens to respect we deserve, the 4-6 has declared he's out on a platform. Oh, by the way, the people that work for him, like the employees and stuff like that, they didn't get the message. They got it on Twitter. They, you know, they're like, hey, are we fired? Are we fired? What's, I mean, what's happening here? Four six ghosted us. There you go. He seems like he was too scared to go one on one with the four five. LBJ in nineteen sixty eight. This excuse me. LBJ in nineteen sixty eight. This is not. In fact, this withdrawal in tone, tenor, shame, and bitterness calls to mind none other than Nixon resignation. The 4-6 has humiliated himself, the sleeping giant, the left, mega donors, and others, and namblers who spent years covering for him. Now you have this one individual, I forget his name, he's that young kid, Harris, no, uh, I, I forget his name, but the, he's the one, that young kid, he's like, 
uh, the four or five is going to be sending his uh, secret service to s search me or something like that. It's a young kid. Uh, again, he's coming out. He's endorsing Harris. I mean, there's so many endorsing uh, Harris right now. Even uh, Hillary and Bill and uh, others. So it says here, and he didn't even initially endorse his VP. Uh, he did. He did endorse her. Someone had to clean up aisle nine on X with a hasty follow-up of VP endorsement tweet. What? I believe it is the best interest of my party and the land for me to stand down. At the very last minute, huh? At the very last minute. Here's a ladder read, finally. Now you have DR, again, I'm saying DR, follow me on this one. Jill must be under heavy sedation. Her personal account on X, as of this writing, is still bannered. Let's finish the job. She could only bring herself to retreat her husband's letter with no remarks of her own, just a love heart emoji. Stay classy, Jill and Joe. So suddenly, this Sunday afternoon announcement, and by the way, today is ice cream day. Ice cream. He loves ice cream. Uh, this afternoon announcement land that one wonders if it was released before the 4-6 could change his mind. Before, oh, by the way, um, he's going to pardon his beloved S-O-N. All right, so before, you know who could fly back from his Malibu mans? Before the 44th will be forced to give the fatal shove. Announcement of his magnitude are typically presaged with an alert to the N-E-W-S. Early reports are that the 4-6 Joey top campaign staff didn't know about the letter no one knew everybody woke up uh what what happened i didn't get nothing he just stepped down i didn't it seems like at the very last minute joe's like i'm out of here you should have let your people know with a handful told just one minute before someone pushed published and all raises more questions such as who wrote it when was it drafted? Was it his decision alone? Or was he... Co co uh, excuse me, guys. Coerced said or coerced. I truly apologize about the word. So it says here, why didn't the 4-6, like LBJ before him, announce his monumental decision to stand down during a primetime televised address from the Oval? Is he that far gone? Unable to re -pre uh, prepare marks from a teleprompter. Who is running this sleeping giant? This truly is the only question that matters. Yet, in this boilerplate, thoroughly self-aggrandizer uh, letter, in which the 4-6 claims he's pulled an FDR with the sleeping giant economy and says he's left the sleeping giant better than he found it. I guarantee this sleeping giant is going to collapse. The sleeping giant has never been better positioned to lead than we are today. It's going to collapse. It's going to collapse. He says he's going to serve the rest of his term. What's remaining? 16 weeks, something like that. Yes, the 4-6 focus. Something he has lose. Um possession of from the hours of 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. is now unfulfilling my duties as leader until January. Read this, my friends. In a Jose Joe whisper, he can't do it. So what if, let's say what if, what if, I'm, I'm just saying, what if Harris wins? Then he's going to be like, I'm back. <laughs> just imagine that. But well, I don't mean it like that. I just want to take a vacation. Fool the sleeping giant. This man has no business staying in the most consequential job on the planet. He has no business with access to the nuclear. Woo. 
He needs to resign immediately, turn the keys over to the VP, and prep for what should be an in-depth investigation into the cover-up regarding his wild personal stuff. Hmm, we're gonna find out. Shame on the 44th. Shame on Mrs. 33,000 emails. Shame on Nancy and every lawmaker who knew the truth and kept Shame on every NEWS who had faced time with the leader and refused to break the biggest political scandal since Walter, you know who. And shame on the LEFT if they tried to keep Joe in the Oval. Yep, he shouldn't be there one more day. Who in the spotlight press pool will finally confront this lawlessness administration? And everybody talks bad about the 4-5. And the 4-5 is going to court. All this here, ladies and gentlemen, this is what you call tree zoom. I'm not going to say the full name. But who in the world? Who's running the land right now? Who is he? The 4-6? The 4-6, he just dropped out. He said that he's not, he's not going to do it no more. He's going to pass the torch to the VP. So the VP right now, the VP is running the sleeping giant. The four six cannot say, hey, I gotta, you know, I'm gonna finish. No, no, it doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. It's like, it's like you're punching out. Hey, I just punched out. But let me just work for another four hours. No, you punched out. It means that you clocked out. That's it. Go home. So it, it, it just doesn't make any sense here, ladies and gentlemen. What's going on? Who in the world is running the Sleeping Giant? We're going to find out. But I told you guys, as we get closer and closer to November, there's going to be some stuff to come. And I've been saying this for the last couple of days. There's going to be something to come. And many, many Sleeping Giant need to be prepared spiritually, physically, and mentally. And if he... Step down due to his personal issue, H-E-A-L-T-H. Then those that was with him, they could get in trouble for that. Because they didn't say nothing. You're not supposed to have someone that has personal issue running a sleeping giant land. That's why there's a thing called the, the test. You got to take the test. He probably took it. And boy, oh boy, it was probably terrible. So we're going to find out sooner or later, guys. Once again, very important information, very, very important update. If you can, please share the video. I got some more video coming up over my new channel, The Rise Up Warrior. Make sure you subscribe to that channel. All right, so I will leave all the information in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, for those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago. Oh, my wife, Jessica Santiago at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get to access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about in the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those link will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ. For he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.